Okay, hello everybody. Welcome back to my channel. It feels like forever since I've filmed a sit down video. Honestly, I feel like I forgot what a studio light is. So today I'm here with another clothing haul. I'm super excited to film this. If you guys watch my channel, you'll know that I'm basically obsessed with clothes. It's actually worrying like how many clothes I have, but I'm here with another haul. So Miss Pat kindly said that I could pick some items off their website for summer and I thought, yeah, I love their clothes. I've ordered from them before. I really, really like them and I was so excited and I'm just going to get straight in with it because I think I went a bit overboard and there are a lot of random things in this haul like I was just going at it on the website I was literally just like I don't know what I want I'm just gonna get one of everything so I'm super grateful thank you so much Miss Pat for working with me on this it's not sponsored it is just gifted but I thought I'd let you guys know so without further ado let's get into it <laughs> okay, I'm honestly obsessed with everything like I don't know where to even start So I'm just gonna start with what's in front of me. So the first thing that I have here is a top now This is a baby pink kind of like ruffle top with straps like this now If you guys have watched me or you've seen my Instagram you would know that I'm obsessed with this kind of color I wear pink a lot. I don't actually know if pink suits me. Why do I look really overexposed? That's better I was overexposed. I'm not even sure that pink is my color, but I really like it this shade of pink especially is my favorite I ordered this in a size 10 and to be honest it does look a bit wide I definitely could have gone a size down I'm gonna try it on and let you guys see what it looks like and um, I think it's so nice for summer and also I think that like spring as well it's like a really nice spring top obviously it's not spring but you know when spring rolls around again okay so I'm sorry if there's a little bit of background noise but this is the pink top now I actually really like this it is ever so slightly too big which I think I knew when I ordered it it probably would be but I decided to go for a bigger size um, because I would rather it be too big than too small because I can alter it But generally speaking, I really like this. I love the like real detail here I think that is really pretty especially if you're on holiday Just makes it look a little bit like more put together like you put a bit more effort in and I do really like the color I think it is a color that kind of suits me. I never really know where I stand with pink It's like does it doesn't it but I quite like this so I'd give it a 6 out of 10 But I'd give it like a 9 if it was the size down So I think I'll just alter it because it is elasticated. It would be easy to do. Okay, so the the next thing that I have is a co set. Now, I'm obsessed with co -ords. I just never know when to wear them, but I think I have the perfect occasion for this one. So, it's really hard to show you it without just having it on, but basically, this is the skirt, so you can see the detailing on it is like the red and the green, and I'm not gonna lie, this reminds me of like Gryffindor and Slytherin, like getting the Harry Potter vibes from this skirt. And then it has the matching top, obviously, which basically it does up as a zip at the front. It does not go all that way down. It does up, but it just won't fasten, and I'm gonna try on anyway but yeah I really like this I think that it's super super simple and wearable because it's so straightforward but then it's also looks like you've put a lot more effort in than you actually have because it's like a matching set so I'm thinking I might wear this for summer in the city it depends how tanned I am and how like confident I feel in it but I'm very excited to try it on fingers crossed it fits I think I got this in a size 10 as well I think I ordered everything in a size 10 because from my experience with ordering with online websites is that you usually have to go not a size up but like I size up just because the size 8s are usually like not the same as a size 8 I would try on in a shop I don't know I'm generally a size 8 or a 10 but I would always go for a 10 online so yeah I think I got these in a 10 okay so then this is the co-op and I absolutely love this. This is literally my favorite thing that I've probably bought in a very long time It is a super high-waisted skirt and it fits perfectly the band is ever so slightly too big But you can't tell um, and I love that it just is very simplistic But it matches and I love that this is a zip because you can kind of decide like where you want it to be I mean obviously you wouldn't have it like that But you can do it like all the way up or you can do it like a bit undone And I do just think that this is really nice like with the right accessories good pair of earrings nice bag this looks so much more expensive than what it is because it was so affordable so yeah it's linked down below but this is my favorite so far for sure okay so the next thing is super straightforward very easy very simple it is basically just a white bandeau top and this is like you know very very small it's also upside down there we go i probably wouldn't wear it in this country as much just because there's not a lot of fabric on this and it would have to be very warm although it has been very hot in england recently but i would probably wear this like on holiday nice pair of shorts and i think i'll take it away with me when i go to lanzarote which is where i am currently when you're watching this which is why i'm not vlogging this week 
week. I hope you guys don't mind. I have already explained it in a vlog, but just in case you didn't see it. So yeah, this is a size, what size is this? This is a size eight actually, because I thought with it being elasticated, it will stretch. Prices for everything, by the way, are all in the description. Like I've put the prices and the link in the description. So as always, if you're interested in anything, you guys can go down below, purchase it or just see the price. Okay, so this is the white top. I really like this. This is actually so nice. I think an eight and it being slightly smaller is definitely the right thing to do because it means the elastic is not moving like this would not go anywhere um so you guys can see this is what it looks like from the front and the back um and yeah it's just really easy to wear it's probably definitely probably definitely definitely gonna be nice on holiday and i'm kind of tanned right now so i think it stands out really nicely against a bit of sun tan so the next thing is quite adventurous i actually really like it but i can definitely see that this would not be to everybody's taste and it is this mesh crop top with very flared sleeves like okay i think i would have to be feeling very bold to wear this i think i will take it on holiday day because obviously with it being mesh it is quite thin although mesh makes you sweat so maybe I won't but yeah I don't usually wear red so I think this is quite bold they do it in other colors but I really wanted to try it because I really want red to suit me like I don't know what I need to do I think it's just my skin tone doesn't suit red that much but so many people pull off red and look so sassy and like amazing I try it on I just look like a washed out egg maybe this will be the top where I can start introducing red into my life but I thought that with a pair of black jeans or black shorts this would look really nice. I'm hoping it looks like it did on the website because realistically this might look really stupid on me. Fingers crossed it doesn't. Let's try it on. Okay, so this is this top. It actually fits really nicely. It's like just about the right size and I've just popped under it like a Calvin Klein sports bra because I don't really know what I'd wear under this. I'd probably wear a bralette but for the sake of this I'm wearing, I'm wearing a sports bra. Um, I really like it but I do think the sleeves are a little bit too much. Like I, I really would want to wear this and I would get ready in it and then I'd go out and feel a bit self-conscious because I do feel like I could be an ABBA maybe like yeah I, I do really like it I think the design is lovely I really am a fan of mesh I think that it's a really nice trend because it allows you to wear really nice underwear that you maybe wouldn't wear uh, obviously not this but like oh I don't know I really like the detailing of the back it is a zip uh which just is pretty straightforward and easy although difficult to do up if you're on your own so yeah i'm gonna give it like an 8 out of 10 because i think it is beautiful and i think that when i'm stood like this as an outfit this is quite cool like i really do like it but i would feel quite self-conscious in these sleeves oh i don't know maybe i could just cut the sleeves off it they do have an adjustment like i could i could unpick them but i don't know if that's a bit too much effort i really like it if you're brave and bold and really sassy and confident go for it and i think this would suit you so much okay so the next thing i got was another bikini and you're probably thinking molly you've ordered so many bikinis but i am so particular when it comes to which ones i actually wear like all of the ones that i bought i really like and then i try them on and i'm like no i can't go out in that even though they're nice i think this one's probably gonna be the same and I'm not gonna lie I did order it for the color so it is this now this is like the top I actually really like it it's lilac and it just looks like a sports bra which is why I kind of like it because the attention in this one is meant to be on your bum so the top is quite simplistic and then the shorts and they're not shorts they're like very very cheeky are like those kind of ones where they're quite up your bum but like they don't look like that on they're like go up your hip if you know what i mean i'm gonna try them on but i'm not gonna show you fully because like i'd basically be naked but i'm gonna try it on anyway um but the main reason i was drawn to this is the color like this shade of purple is my absolute favorite like i absolutely love lilac so much so yeah i really wanted a lilac bikini for so long and this is so extra but i'm getting my nails done tomorrow in purple so i thought if i could take a purple bikini how put together would i look with my matching nails and bikini that is very over the top i know but right okay so you have to just bear with the fact that this is a dodgy angle but this is the bikini i'm not going to turn around but from the front it doesn't actually look like as skimpy as it looked when i was holding it up but i'm not going to turn around i actually really like it it's very rare that i like a bikini top that is this style but i think that this actually works and i would i really wish i had this when i went on holiday to ibiza and to madrid because none of my bikinis were like flattering like this they were just all like regular um and this is more of like a love island style bikini so yeah i really quite like this and i wish i'd had it earlier so definitely gonna give this a 10 the quality feels nice it's a little bit too big i ordered it in a 10 the back is ever so slightly too big but if i'd have gone a size down there would have been no room at the front so swings and roundabouts i guess i need a size nine that's what size i am so to go alongside that bikini i then ordered something i've wanted and been looking for for so long every night when i watch love island i look at their like cover-ups and their sarongs and like their beach dress 
dresses and I'm like where are they getting those from? I think the answer is Miss Pat. So I found this one which I am obsessed with. It's basically just a wrap around skirt tie. It's got like ties here and it looks kind of like a curtain. But it's just like sheer white and I have a really, really love-hate relationship with this fabric. When I did GCSE textiles, I chose to make my entire final piece out of chiffon like this. And oh my god, it was like stabbing myself in the back a hundred times. I don't know why I did it, but I got an A in the end and I like liked my final piece, but it was a pretty horrific ordeal to get there. So I don't really like this fabric. However, when I'm wearing it and not working with it, I think it's really pretty. And I think over the purple bikini, it's just gonna look so nice. So yeah, I'll try that on with the bikini for you so this is it with the cover up i actually love this like it is such a nice combination i think the white is really flattering on the purple and it does kind of cover the bum not really like it's very see-through but that's kind of what it's meant for it's just like to throw on and it would be good to have because if you covered yourself in it it would like not stop you getting sunburn, but it would act as like a nice, you know, a bit of shade from the sun, even though it's very see-through. But I really like this. I'm so glad I have it. The only downside to it is it is slightly too long, which is weird because I am five foot seven, so usually things are too short on me. And I've tied it quite high up, like it's not around my waist, it's like more around my ribs. Uh, and it's still like I might trip over it so I'd have to be quite careful walking in it but other than that I really like this and then switching seasons completely I'm now going to show you a jumper which doesn't really look how it looked on the website and it's basically this massively oversized cropped like exceptionally cropped stripy jumper with the longest sleeves in the world so i already know that this is going to be too big and i ordered this in a small slash medium so like realistically i'm not that small i'm quite a tall girl and i'm like average size i would say this is not a small this is huge so i'm gonna try it on i love the color combinations like the pastels are really really nice i thought it'd be great for autumn so yeah let's try that on okay so actually now i have this on it isn't as cropped as it looks like to start off with at the back and at the front it is it does like go up obviously like ooh, ooh. um and i wouldn't wear it with the skirt but i don't actually hate this like i mean the arms are ridiculous because it's all one piece of fabric which is like kind of cool but also like a bit annoying because when you move your arm that happens and that's not cute but yeah generally speaking i think that this would be nice maybe over a dress so say if you had like a plain bodycon dress on and then you paired this over the top of it in winter that would look really nice so imagine that this was a dress i think that that would look nice and then you wouldn't have the issue of it rising up but generally i would give this like an 8 out of 10 because I do think it's a cool design and I really like the print and the colours but yeah it is a little bit of an odd one like look at that <laughs> <laughs> and then the last piece of clothing I ordered was a pair of gym leggings. Now, I don't have that much hope for these because on the website they looked great, but I think you have to have the best bum in the world to pull these off. So they're basically just black leggings and then on the back they've got like this grey that kind of runs and then here there's like a, a cut out, which looks lovely, but if your bum's not great, you just look a bit like you've got no bum. So I'm going to try them on. Don't know what they're going to look like. I got them in a size 10 and hopefully they fit because I've had such a bad experience with ordering leggings online. So hopefully these ones are the ones. They look the right length. That's a start. Okay, so I don't actually hate these leggings. These are the gym leggings. And I mean, the bum is a little bit questionable and you can see my pants through it. But I think as a general rule, these are quite nice. I really like the cut out bits. I don't know if you can see that. It's like, like netting almost, like mesh. And I do like them. They're not as high-waisted as my other pair. My other pair of gym leggings come literally like up to here, which is amazing. Yeah, I don't dislike these. They are, they are nice. The form is a little bit weird, but but I'll probably wear them, let's be honest. Moving away from clothing, and probably my favourite item from this entire haul, I ordered this bag. Now, I think that this is absolutely gorgeous. It's, like, got a chain, but then the chain has a fabric-y bit, and it's studded, and it's magnetic, and it opens up. I think it's meant to look like a fake Versace bag. I think it's Versace that do the studs. But, yeah, I really, really love this. It was about a tenner, but it looks so much more expensive. Like, this could be designer, and you wouldn't even question it. Quality feels nice. Got really nice lion head detailing. I don't know if you can see that. Like, I love the detail of this here. Like these are really cool. So yeah, I absolutely love this. And then lastly, and something that is a little bit of a fail, but I'm gonna show you anyway. I ordered a pair of shoes. So to start off with, they're not very me. Like I've never really worn trainers. I've just never been that person that wears Adidas trainers. I wish I was. People look really cool in them, but I feel like I've left it too late now to become that person. Like I will forever be Converse and Vans, and that is like it because I just don't get the trainer trend, don't shoot me. But I tried to jump on it anyway. Now, obviously these are not branded. Um, these are like by Miss Pap. And to be fair, these are really nice. They're like a really nice shoe. You could decide which color you got on the back. So I went for baby pink, shock. These 
these don't fit me like i ordered them in my size which is like a six and a half or a seven so i ordered them in a seven these fit my mom and my mom's a size five like you can see that is a small shoe like it's not it's not a size seven so just be very wary if you order shoes i, I would like to rebuy these in the right size because i did put them on and they felt comfy everywhere like other than the fact that they were two sizes too small lovely shoe it just doesn't fit me so yeah that is actually everything guys i hope you've enjoyed this haul if you have be sure to give it a huge thumbs up let me know down in the comments which your favorite item was um and as i have already mentioned if you're interested in any of them they're all linked down below you can check them out buy them for yourself if you think they would suit you but yeah i hope you're all having a lovely summer i hope you enjoy this week's videos i have a couple going up none of them are vlogs but i will be back with the vlogs next week so yeah i'll see you all on thursday with a drive with me i know you guys have missed the drive with me i'm excited to bring it back so hopefully you guys will enjoy that smash the thumbs up subscribe if you're new and i will see you all there bye Love.